OK, Dave, look after yourself, mate. Catch you soon. Uh, G-A-D-E-R. Uh, this is G-3-0 Papa Sugar resigning, and uh, we'll be listening for the next few minutes on this frequency. Cheers, Dave. Yeah, cheers, Steve. All, all the very best, and uh, certainly look forward to you speaking to you again. Golf 8 Delta, Echo Radio, clear. G3ZPS, Golf 4 Papa, Foxtrot, Zulu. G4PFZ, oh, I'll just grab a drink here. Uh, G4PFZ, another call that isn't very familiar from uh, decades ago. Name is Steve, Sugar Tango Echo Victor Echo Steve. The boy. The bull tabularaz. Eh, diciamo, eh, ma da quella parte, se vola la mosca, se cattura. Buonanotte, Mauro, buonanotte, Alberto. Qui è il K0, Fidel. G stations or EI stations for that matter at all. So um, I, I just literally might have made a few QSOs into Europe and then I packed up and went away. So um, <clears throat> that's uh, that's good. You're back up again now. You're just 15 dB over S9 again, Stuart. So like you say, it's up and down somewhat. Uh, there's no doubt about it there. So I'm just back looking at the old uh, the old antennas here again. 204 pounds 10 plus 12 pounds packaging for a dipole. I tell you one thing, I have to hand it to him. Good luck to him if you can get it there, Stuart Over. Oh, yeah, big time, yeah. And best of luck to him. Some gob shout to buy it, you know. Um, Oscar 5, Kilo India, Delta, Oscar 5, Kilo India, over. Uh, India, Delta, India, Delta. and uh, I determined to somehow get this uh, 40 metres of wire out somewhere. <laughs> uh, and I, I've sort of encroached on uh, on some sort of uh, public land, shall we say. So whether it gets noticed, Steve, and, and I get asked to take it down, we'll have to keep our fingers crossed. <laughs> but what I was using before was, uh, say, it was a real compromise antenna, and that, and that performed like one too. It was um, something I bought at the hand press. And it was like an offset of fed um, uh, dipole, but with a with a um, um, with a coil in one one side on the on the small side of the uh, um, center, and, uh, and it was meant to tune 80 through to 10. Well, it may have ended up on 80, but most of the power I think was coming back into the shack, and uh, it was uh, it was wiping out my uh, monitor. So 
that made me struggle even more in the contest because uh, every time I made a contact, I had to sort of get the monitors to come back on again for I'd log a HI, so that made it even more difficult. And as soon as I got this antenna up yesterday, um, put me 100 watts on, and, and the monitor is lovely and stable, so I'm a very happy boy, uh, Steve.